so many like ruins everywhere. Walking back to Oh my chocolate workshop where So all this on the ground is like coloured sawdust for the Easter parades and they're just like doing little bits over here and then the parade back there with all the angels like walk over it it's like incense Hello, we've made it to Guatemala. We're currently in Antigua and it's Easter Sunday today. There's a massive parade. We saw a bit of the parade last night. Oh, and these gunshot sounds keep going off and scaring the shit out of us. But we're hoping to catch a bit of this parade. This is crazy. Very hectic. That we are just walking on the side of the streets while this parade goes down and walks over all the like decorative carpets that the locals have been like doing the last couple of days. But like the music, the trumpets, the drums. Hundreds of people. So many people. <laughs> oh my god. Was so cool. I wasn't gonna start vlogging today because like it's Easter but we saw that and I thought that is something that I've never witnessed ever. So we're here we're in Antigua I'll just like give you guys a little catch up while we're walking back to our conclusion. Oh my goodness that cannon gets me every single time. It's just a cannon going off. We're in Antigua. We originally booked four nights we've just extended it to another three because there's so much to see and do. A lot of like volcanic hikes we can do. The ruins. Oh my god, that cannon's getting closer and closer. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy this vlog. I don't know what's gonna happen because we've got absolutely nothing planned. Yeah, keen to see what we get up to. And so, how cool is this clock tower? It's like what Antigua is known for. So we just on our way home and we saw this church that people were like up the top of. So we've just come in, it cost us $5 each. And it's like massive, like it looks small from the outside, but then it's like massive on the inside. Yeah. And it's like very ruined. But then the front part is all this beautiful yellow done up. Yeah, it's all restored. The and then all the back here, look, look, you can see over there, all the little cannons around there massive waterfall in the middle fountain it's crazy and then look at this with the mountains in the background it's beautiful so we're gonna try to get up here Market. We've had some dinner, but I'm here for a little sweet treat. Trying to find some churros. But look at all these sweetness. I think they're like really big churros. But we're just walking through. They've got like heaps of stores with like food and stuff and street food. And then they're like all making it here. Hola! A churro? Um, chocolate. I have five. Gracias. Oh my god, that looks so good. I kind of regret not getting caramel, but like chocolate goes with churros. Yeah, chocolate. Mm. Good. Oh my god, they're so doughy and thick. 
pretty good. Okay, can you hold? Good morning, we've just made it to a like lookout viewpoint of the whole of Antigua and this is the view that we're looking at. So cool. And then there, if it's like a clear day, that's like the volcano, but you yeah. can't see the top. You can just, if you, you can just see the outline. The camera, you just see the top. Oh of yeah, you can just yeah, see up just there. Just through the clouds, top of the clouds. Yeah, not sure if you guys can see that, but yeah. we're surrounded by all these other mountains and then there's a massive volcano and then this city here. And then you've got like a Christ cross up there and a lookout. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna walk back down and then I think we're gonna go see if we can do the chocolate class today yep. and also go and see the travel um, the volcano guide. Yeah. To go and hike up the volcano and hopefully do the night trip. So that's on the agenda for today. Okay, we just started walking back to like the main area and I love how there's just so many like ruins everywhere. Yeah. Just old buildings. Looks like it's sort of the front of someone's house yeah. now. And, yeah. So they've got like the front of it, but all the back's gone as you can like yeah. see all the inside. Leave but, someone's oh, property. And all the details on them. It's so ancient and so beautiful. We just booked in for our chocolate workshop. Um, didn't have any available times today, so we're doing it tomorrow at 11 a.m. at this place, which was highly recommended. So super keen for that. Now it's time to get some food. We're waiting on some tacos, but this is the view that we have from sitting here of this old ruin, like just out the window. Look at this spread. Get some chicken, some birria. Avocado bites. Gracias. Good to go. Wash it down. Good morning. We have just picked up our laundry. We dropped it off yesterday and it was ready this morning. And now we're heading to do a like chocolate workshop where we get to like go from the cacao bean to making our very own chocolate bar. And we can put in like all our own flavors and everything like that. Anyway, we went with um, Choco Muso. I heard so many good things about this on like TripAdvisor, Google and TikTok. A few other people have done it and left some amazing reviews. So let's go make a chocolate bar from scratch. Ryan's trying to So we got. What did you put on there? Sprinkles, cranberries, salt, like raisins, peanuts. I ended up doing sprinkles, sea salt, chili, cinnamon. Random weird combo. So we just got given a cacao seed to try each. Here we go. Not what I was expecting. We're going to suck it and then you chew it. Outside, delicious. The inside's a bit. Ugh. Gracias. 